Loose dogs are an issue in Victoria. Despite the existence of lease laws, not all pet owners keep their dogs on a leash. News Center 25's Carolina Astrain spoke with the chief animal control officer to learn what to do when a loose dog attacks. Lucy, an 11-year-old Havanese, was out for a walk with her owner when she was attacked by a loose dog. It was an attack the house dog, known for her loving, friendly nature, did not survive. Her owners say Lucy was a great companion that would try to sit on your lap if you let her. Jose Flores works for the Victoria County Animal Control Department. Uh, it, it's a problem that Victoria County in general has been dealing with for many years. And I think a lot of that just results from just not the knowledge of knowing what you're supposed to do with a pet. Flores says there are a total of six people part of his team. Though our three ACOs are mainly the ones out on the field on a regular basis, uh, if things get a little too active and we have too many things, our supervisors will go into the field as well to, to answer calls for service. There are 18 runs for dogs at animal control, which are usually full, especially around springtime, when several owners choose to surrender their pets after they are able to start reproducing. Usually a puppy given as a gift at Christmas. Because those animals weren't fixed and they got a brand new puppy and never got it done, that puppy grows up and within six months, can, if it's a female, she can go into heat and start have, to have her first litter of puppies within the first six months. If you see a loose dog, call Animal Control at 361-578-3564 or 911 if it's after hours. Also do your part and keep your pet on a leash. For your hometown news, I'm Carolina Strain.